Okay, so here's the tank that I'm going to use. It's a hot water tank. It's been stripped down. Foam's been pulled off. It's actually a small tank. It's only got probably a three inch bore in it. <clears throat> but this right here is where I'm going to feed the thermoplastics down inside. And then on the side here, I'm going to cut in a, a vent. And then on the bottom, <coughs> I'm going to uh, cut a big hole where my burn bowl goes. It's probably about uh, 12 inches. And then inside that 12 inch hole, I'm going to cut this, this plate down, this pipe. So my burn bowl actually uh, fits in that. So uh, I'm probably not going to have to chop that much off. So this pipe right here will stick down in my burn bowl. I'll show you that a little bit later on. So yeah, this is the bottom of the tank. And then I've just got to put legs on the tank to uh, raise it up high enough so I can feed my burn bowl in and out. And then I'm going to control the heat with these vents right here. So the amount of oxygen going in will determine how fast the, the plastic burns. So we'll see what happens. I'll give you an update. Okay, so I've decided to reverse the process here. Instead of using the top, I'm using, uh, instead of using the bottom for the burn bowl, I'm, I'm going at the top. Now, the reason why, this is actually my burn bowl right here. I gotta cut this, cut this off somewhere and the bottom's gonna be my burn bowl. But if you notice, it's almost perfect where I've gotta cut this out for the burn bowl. It goes right around here. And I like the fact that the pipe's sticking out farther here, um, which I may still have to cut some of this off, but I can use this and put it on the top and weld it in to extend that out. And then I'll add a vent somewhere in the here. So, uh, out now actually that'll go on the bottom. Um, so this will just be strictly burn bowl. This is actually gonna be the bottom of my uh, apparatus. And then I'll, I'll vent the air here. I probably will end up cutting a two inch fitting in here so I can see everything what's going on and um, and then I can light it through there too as well so all right I'm gonna cut this um, tank down which is just a freon tank and then I'll show you a little bit later on what that looks like okay so this this is what it ended up looking like so this is the pipe that went all the way through it's still all the way through comes out the bottom uh, and that's where I'm gonna drop my uh, plastic in and then the burn bowl goes in here so here's what my burn bowl looks like you want these clean too by the way so they don't have contaminants like dirt you want to start out clean and then this burn bowl I'm gonna sit in there like that I'm gonna put legs on this next. And that's what I'm doing right now. I'm just gonna weld some legs on it so it sits up so I can put the burn bowl in. So I'll, uh, I'll take another picture later. Okay, here's the uh, unit burning. It's actually burning right now, thermoplastic. And uh, no smoke. So thermoplastic is actually oil made into thermoplastic. So you can see down in there, down in the burn bowl. That's what it's doing. Hopefully it didn't melt my camera. And then uh, my burn bowl down here, you can see it's, it's got hot enough to burn off the paint. And so I'm kind of just regulating it to see what, I mean, I've definitely got enough temperature to heat a small hut. There's no doubt about it. Um, and so I'm making some adjustments. To, actually, this one I'm trying to burn slow. And so uh, I'm seeing how long. I've got the tube stuffed, which is right here. Stuffed tube. I've got thermoplastic stuffed down into there, and that pipe goes down into the burn bowl. So I'm seeing how long it takes to empty that pipe, how long of a burn time, kind of to see what's going on. So I'm kind of testing things right now. So I just got some things temporarily. Like, uh, I don't have a stand on the burn bowl. I just got some stuff underneath it. And I'm going to cut in an inspection hole over here. So I don't have to look through the smokestack to see the fire. I'm going to cut in right, right there. Which right now, I've got one hole closed off. 
and I'll probably put a uh, welder light, threader light on the other one, and so that'll actually be my adjustment, how, how, how fast it burns. So, because um, that's my air, oxygen and getting to the fire, basically. Um, and so that's kind of how you can regulate that. I'm still working on that and finalizing it. So, but yeah, all this wasted plastic that we're just throwing down into the river and then out into the ocean, it's basically oil we're sitting there waiting to fire up. Nobody wants to tell you that, but that's what it is. See ya, bye.